her phone. He pistol whipped her and kicked her three times in the head and face before taking off with tens of thousands of dollars worth of hot handbags. To have her, someone put a gun in her face is just very, very disturbing. Police say these men, Diamante Butler and Tim Jones, were the men in this video terrorizing the women. Over the course of a week, six Central St. Martin's graduates across fine art, fashion, graphic design and architecture will be taken back to basics to discover if the school's groundbreaking approach to training artists still holds its power a hundred years on. It feels like I'm at a crazy boot camp, but I don't know what's coming next. Each day, the students will be challenged to create a new work of art, design or performance, sticking strictly to rules inspired by the artists who taught at the Bauhaus. From Oscar Schlemmer, the cutting-edge costume designer, to Vasily Kandinsky, one of the early pioneers of abstract art, the Bauhaus tore up the old rules of art and design and placed radical new ones in their place. Yes. Setting the rules for our students will be key figures from today's worlds of art and design. Leaping and wild stamping the feet are absolutely essential. Now, in my experience, art school students don't like sticking to the rules. Surveillance video caught eight young men rushing into a store all at once. In just seconds, they grab everything they can. Then they run for it. A store employee tries to stop them, but he's outnumbered. It's a $2,500 robbery committed in just 11... Say this same group has used this tactic to rob three sporting goods stores in the last month. Some of the men proudly showing off their loot. Either they didn't know they were being recorded or they didn't care. But neighbors are hoping someone recognizes them and turns them...